President Simmons, 11 years ago, Brown invited you to become our president. You came, you saw, and you won the hearts of generation of students, faculty, staff members, parents, and alumni. By taking us to the 21st century, you left your mark on this institution forever. Among snowy mountains, the one moving thing was the eye, the eye of the blackbird on wing. I don't know if I can leave this place. I know I will look for you beneath the shadows of trees, under rocks deepen the soil and try to find my way back to your voices. To tell everyone who comes in and out of this space that, that our ghosts once haunted, haunted this place, that, that our words shook these walls, tweaked every floorboard in this house, tore down every shutter flailing in the wind. But this time, and I promise this time, I, I will, will never, never ever, ever forget. forget. <laughs> Imagine us We could never have imagined that today we would say farewell. As your time at Brown is coming to a close, we would be remiss if we did not also say a job well done. You have shown us all how to dream big and make the impossible a reality. Thank you above all for always putting Brown first. Until the storm bursts and the white winged shadow Nearly tore through the I love you, Ruth! How can I ever adequately thank you for what you have given to me over these past years? I can't. I came here fearful that people would judge me harshly and not accept me for who I am. What I found instead was a welcoming community of individuals who challenged me, who taught me, who loved me, who did everything a friend a partner could do to make me feel comfortable here. You make it the most special of places. And for me, the experience of working with you, alongside you, for you, has been the best of my life. And I cannot thank you enough for that. <laughs>